Walpole Film Festival started in 2003 as one of the first high school film festivals in the country. The program has been recognized nationally as a model for creativity and collaboration in the classroom. Students in the program are required to follow each step in modern independent digital filmmaking. This includes screenwriting, acting, art direction, shooting on digital cameras, editing on professional software, and composing original music. The festival culminates each year with a red carpet ceremony that celebrates the achievements of each crew. To learn more about this year's Walpole Film Festival and how to become a sponsor, please visit our website, walpolefilmfestival.com. Thank you and enjoy the movie. Set a reminder to never have the buff chicks for lunch ever again. Reminder set. Stop right there. Excuse me, Owen. Why aren't you in lunch? I just had lunch. I'm in math class right now. Yeah, you would be in math class if you weren't skipping. I'm just going to the bathroom. Have another note. I don't want to see you skipping last block study again. Understood? Oh, come on, man. I gotta let my grandma out at 1.30. She hasn't eaten in two weeks. Oh, a rule is a rule. Now, if I see you skipping last block study again, I will look for you. I will find you. And ah, I've seen the movie, okay? You're not Liam Neeson. Imbush accused me of trying to leave during study hall. Well, were you gonna leave during study hall? Well, yeah. So he was right. Yeah, he was right. But that's not the point. It's literally study hall. Ugh, I seriously hate him. If I could just send Imbush an email, I'd say to him, you're a big, dumb, obnoxious baby. Email sent. What, what happened? I didn't mean to actually send that. What are we gonna do? Whoa, whoa, we? What do you mean, we? This is all on you. What, what do we look like, criminals? Yeah, what do we look like, criminals? Did somebody say criminals? What were you guys talking about? Get out of here, Janice! This doesn't concern you! If it's about school rules, then it does concern me and Mr. Powers. Whatever, Janice. Yo, let's go. We need to get into Ambush's office and erase that email somehow. Like, a heist. A heist? Did someone just say a heist? Yeah, yeah, I said a heist. I want to be a part of a heist my whole life. Well, that's good, because we're breaking into Ambush's no, office. No, 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 we're not breaking into anywhere. Oh, you bet we are. Can I be the eye in the sky, please? I have a van and everything ready to go. I don't care. We're not pulling off a heist. Oh, come on, man. He already has a van ready. Fine, you know what, fine. But this better be good because I'm not having a high score on my record. Yes! Okay, here's the plan. Huddle up, huddle up. All right. Mr. St. Martin, what are you doing getting involved with these criminals? Teachers shouldn't be involved with criminals. Get out of here, Janice. This doesn't concern you. Well, where were we? Bald Eagle has landed. Bald Eagle here. I repeat, the Bald Eagle has landed. No, we're not doing code names, Dad. We just need to finish this up before Imbush gets out of his meeting. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Imbush. We got a perfect distraction for him. Are you ready for entry, Pink Princess? I'm ready, Bald Eagle.
shoot, I'm gonna be late for my dance class. And of course, we've also got the Caesar salad, which we named after him. Which brings us to our number one most influential person, who we have here today. Liam Neeson. Oh look, it's the Timberwolf, right next to the poster of our finest actor. Hey! Don't disrespect my Irish brethren. You better get back here. You better get back here. I can pick you out of a crowd. Come up. Hey. You better get back here. Yeah. I guess so. Yeah, dude, I heard it's getting crazy down there. Buff chick sangs are flying everywhere. What are you guys talking about? Massive food fight in the calf. Seven people have already died. What? I'm telling Mr. Powers. This better be good, Janice. You just interrupted my lunch, and I am pretty hangry right now. Oh, it's good. I heard buff chicks are killing people. <sighs> Mr. St. Martin, am I clear? Mr. St. Martin? Mr. St. Martin? Bald man, bald eagle, whatever your name is, am I clear? Mr. Sim- Oh, screw this. Dave, what are you doing with my van? And why'd you move it out in the alley? Oh, it's just, it's like a little heist going on. No, no, no big deal. Aren't you supposed to be teaching, man? You, you gotta get out of here. Oh, don't worry about that. I got that covered. So clearly the Pythagorean theorem is A squared plus B squared equals C squared. So if you have three Man, Mr. St. Martin is walking it today. Yeah, this is the Literally. best class ever. X squared equals 25. Mr. Inbush, uh, what's up? What are you doing in my office? All right, look, I was mad you wouldn't let me leave during study hall, so I started trash talking you to my friends, but I accidentally sent you an email calling you a baby. Owen, I get emails like that all the time. You don't have to go violating a bunch of rules just because one makes you upset. I am going to have to give you a week's worth of detention, though. A week? More like a month. These hooligans faked a food fight in the cafeteria and they interrupted my lunch. You know what, Mr. Powers? You're right. That'll teach them not to disrespect Liam Neeson. Wait a minute. How'd you get in the costume? And where's Sean? Well... Choke hold the student, at least not with the cameras on. Good point. Listen, boys, we won't give you any detention if you help us delete that footage. That's it? They break all these rules and no detention? What kind of principal are you? Get out of here, Janice. This doesn't concern you. <sighs> so, what? Is this another heist? Did someone say heist? <laughs> 